never trust a big butt and a smile. That girl is Hey there, all my beautiful people, perverts, and fucking haters. It's Candy. Last month, a company by the name of Nature Queen contacted me and asked me if I wanted to review their shampoo and conditioner. Now, first of all, with a name like Nature Queen, girl with the self-proclaimed Nature Queen of South Florida, you know a girl was like, let's look into this. So I did my little research and bitch, all I needed to see was contains herbs that promote hair growth and bitch was in. Okay, so maybe that's not all I needed to see, but as I read down the website, there was so many cool things about this product, like so many cool things. There are so many cool ingredients in it, like trees and grass and wheat and herbs and spices and I mean it's as good as KFC girl. Better actually because KFC is seven herbs and spices I think and this is not bitch. So when I read that I was like hmm I'm actually interested in this product girl. So after I spent about half an hour on their website looking and reading and seeing that it like detoxify it's gonna make my hair shiny and more volume and shit and realized basically it's like a medicine for hair because it's like they talk about things like hair thinning hair lost dandruff you know the list goes on different hair ailments about how these herbs that are in this formula have been used by asian women for years and years to combat these things i said girl sign me up i want to tell you the customer service of nature queen were so nice so cool i was like girl what's the terms so they were kind enough to send it out to me and basically just say, hey, just post on your socials or put in a get ready with me or whatever video, just as long as you give an honest review of it, that's all we really care about. So that's where we are today, girl. So the name of the product is Nature Queen Premium Herbal Shampoo and Conditioner. Sorry, my labels are just a little bit used. I've been using it, girl, for a month now, actually. I wanted to use it for a month so that I could give you guys a 100% honest review and also check it out for myself because I don't want to be like, hey, look at this product I got and then be like, oh yeah, but I really don't like it because I have done that before, not because somebody sent me something. This is really actually the first thing I've ever been sent it is. It's the first thing I've ever been sent free to review. So in doing that, I wanted to make sure that before I gave it a positive review or before I really, really talked about it, I wanted to use it and give it a fair chance. And also because you guys do watch me and you do guys, you guys do go buy a lot of the shit I talk about. I wanted to make sure that like, I really, really, really liked it. So did I, or didn't I? So fucking spoiler alert, I fucking loved it. That's why it got its own, whoops, flew across the room onto my white carpet. Not even mad, girl, not even mad. But that's why I got its own dedicated video because I am in love with this shampoo and conditioner. Legit. Okay, so I actually had Pete film a video of me actually putting the shampoo and conditioner in my hand and in my hair. So as I play that, I'll kind of talk about this real quick. The shampoo, when you first, like it, it was completely, like when I first pumped it, I was like, Girl, girl, what is this? What is this? The brown girl? I'm not a fan of the brown. It looks sticky. It looks like honey, girl. And then the smell at first, you're like, for me, I was first put off by it. At first, I was like, no, girl. Like, because it's like, and now I kind of really like it. It's really funny. It's, remember how Aqua Marina Lush did that to me? At first, I didn't really like it. I was like, and now I'm like, that's all I buy and I love it. Because if something's a good product and all natural, like, I can give up the fruity, girly smells for something a little more natural to be honest. So as you can see, it's like a brownish honey color, almost like clove patchouli's in it, I know, wheat, uh, lemongrass, something like that. But at first, it's, to me, it's if you like fruity, girly smells, at first it's gonna be a little off-putting, but I feel like, like I said, I've grown to like acclimate to it and really kind of enjoy it now. And then the conditioner is more of like a white color. It's very like creamy. It's a little bit hard to pump out of here, I think. But girl, to be honest, I have a sink with some bougie ass soap dispenser on it that that thing is hard to pump out of half the time anyhow. So what do you expect for a little plastic bottle? Speaking of plastic bottles, when I first opened these out of their box, I guess I could have showed you that in the very beginning. I love the little box that they sit in. There's this little box. I got it literally in like two days from California, girl, literally two days from California and they were just like sat in here really nicely I think they might have had a little rib I don't remember honestly it's been a month girl but I was afraid these were glass when I opened them but they're not they're plastic which is great because I drop shit in the shower all the time 
Um, these are the travel size, guys. You can you can actually order this size of them for travel. I think it's about $17. You'd have to check on the website because I don't remember 100%. But I love them so, so, so much that I'm about to order the full size in them because these are going to be out pretty soon because, I, like I said, I've used and used and used them for the last month. And I actually haven't had my friend use it a couple times, too. But I really think it's going to be my new staple shampoo and conditioner. So I know you're not going to really be able to tell because I wear my hair up most of the time. I know that that's just, unfortunately, it's my signature. It's what I like. I feel awkward with my hair down. I don't know why I don't just cut it off because, girl, no, I love my little weird messy bun. Don't judge me. Or do. I don't care. But honestly, anybody that's been around me actually has asked about my hair and said it looks really healthy right now. It's very shiny. I feel like it makes it really, really, really soft. I don't have a whole lot of hair. I have very thin hair. I have very flat hair. Um, but I feel like it's definitely given me some volume. I just washed it this morning and let it air dry. I didn't put any other product in it. And this is what we got, girl. So overall, like I said, I absolutely love the product. I fully intend on buying the full product size, which is, I think is about $30. I don't exactly remember. Once again, go to the website, check it out. I'll have a link below. Love, love, love it. Like I said, at first, the smell a little bit to me. It's like, girl, I need my fruity strawberry watermelon kiwi fruit loop smell, girl. But, but... For what it gives me, girl, and actually it made me feel like more in tune with earth that it has more of a natural herb-like smell. And we all know how I love to herb. So yeah, that's all I have for you today, guys. I hope you enjoyed this review. I hope you try it out. At least try out the trial size because I swear I think you'll love it too. As always, thank you guys so, so much for watching. Thank you so, so much, Nature Queen, for sending me the product. I love it. You've got a new customer. And until next time, guys, be nice to each other because remember, nobody likes a fucking asshole. Bye, guys. If I was you, I'd wanna be me too I'd wanna be me too I'd wanna be me too If I was you, I'd wanna be me too I'd wanna be me too